Greetings everyone, welcome to the channel. I'm your host Gamer Khan and today I'm going to be showcasing this wonderful game that I had with the IS-2, the noble IS-2 here in this desert map which I honest to god can't even remember the name. Uh, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a nice map. I want to talk about this gameplay because it really struck me um, a little bit differently. You see, I'm using an IS-2 and for those of you that know uh, this tank pretty well, it excels at being a very good sniper tank because of its excellent cannon, its uh, amazing round, the velocity, the penetration. However, it does suffer in terms of reload rate. After you fire, you are practically, well, defenseless for about 15 seconds. So being in the front line, it's not really gonna be the best solution. However, there are some players that do not like the fact that we are not uh, brawling in an IS-2. Why? Uh, it's just weird. Now, I mentioned over here, do not charge and feed the enemy because I checked later in the scoreboard, there were a lot of low levels who just got into this 6.0 battle rating, charging up into the open and just getting destroyed relatively quickly like we lost like what four to five tanks immediately now i perch up over here at uh, a5 a very good sniper spot for the tank um i'm not really going to be spawn camping them i'm not doing any of that sort i'm just watching the parameter and making sure that nothing comes my way i make sure that the enemy team doesn't try to flank from behind however um it's going to be a while since anyone comes here so we're just going to be fast forwarding it towards the action now i immediately start spotting tanks coming up over here and then i see this m6a1 charging up i know there's going to be another tank coming up we've lost a lot of players though by the way at this point um we're just losing left right center uh i you know at this point i just basically i was so frustrated i had a long day and um First kill of the game, Tiger won. I really got frustrated mainly because our team just kept getting steamrolled. Look at the map. Look at this. They just storm rushing us at this point. And I'm just like, okay, this is really annoying because we were dealing with so many low levels that they just kept charging up and just dying willy-nilly. And I just really couldn't take it at one point. I was really tired of it after a while. You know, you have a long ass day. You want to try to get uh, some gameplay up on this. Um, and really, they play quite brain dead. I'm, I'm going to stand by that sentence that I said. I know it's relatively rude of me to say it, but I was really frustrated at this point. And um, I stand by what I say. If you're going to charge up in the open and you're going to have a lot of tigers hunting you down, don't complain about it. Don't then whine about the game saying that, oh my god, this game is broken, yada, yada, yada. If you don't understand how you're going to play the tank to its benefits, then really don't play the tank at all. Now, so far at this point, we have very little tanks. The enemy still has practically a full amount of tanks coming towards us at A. I thought, you know what? If I'm going to go, I'm going to go with a bang. I'm not going to give up. I'm not going to lose. I told myself, look, uh, there's no point me complaining about how players bring one tank, uh, rush, and then die. <clears throat> it's not going to help anything at all. Now, I climb up over on this rock, and I start to see the Panther rushing up. I see the Panzer, a lot of vehicles coming up our way. So my eyes are now set for the Panther. I find a nice spot. Panther uh, gets into a position, and this spot is going to be where I really hold the fort. I reverse... Uh, gently go up to make sure I get some depression tank angles down still not enough I'm being very careful not to drop off from the hill and second kill of the game panther down I know there's an M24 up there there's a panzer 470 uh, below I'm going to focus on the M24 because he can scout the panzer is in an awkward position for me I can't really do much M24 is trying to go up that hill I practically already know the range for it Ammunition exploded, third kill of the game. Also, the Panzer on the Panzer 4 on the enemy team is down. And then we now wait for the reload for more tanks to come. Now, as you can see over here, I'm playing the tank to its uh, fullest potential. I'm being a sniper, I'm not being a brawler. Yes, this tank can deflect armor uh, rounds, this tank can deflect uh, well placed shots. Uh, it's got a decent armor, but 
it suffers the same problem as the tiger if you engage it from range you uh, the tiger and is2 is always going to win but if you bring it close range high chances of the enemy just destroying you with relative ease i see this m19 and boom fourth kill of the game long range kill on the is2 not a problem i was like okay range find it it's somewhere around i think 400 or 600 meters fire and boom and i see a jumbo sherman now i know for a matter of fact the jumbo is very powerful on the front and i don't want to whiff my shot so i'm going back to the similar position where i took out that panther Focus on the M19. I don't know how this didn't kill him. Got two of his crewmates. It was a really weird moment. Now the jumbo is rushing very quickly. Now my round ro ro loads up. Sorry, English is uh, dying at this point. Now this is the where the hilarious part. He rolls up and gives me the side shot. <laughs> And now I see this Panzer IV coming. I know this guy is coming for me. I know he's coming for me. I don't have a shot. He's definitely coming for me. There's no way in hell I'm going to get that shot. So what I can do is I can focus on the enemy team that is right now in front of me. Waiting for them to come. Boom. <clears throat> Seventh kill of the game. This Panther doesn't see the muzzle flash. I don't know how. I know that Panther is going to take a while for him to climb up. By the time I reload my second run and kill the second guy, I should be able to engage the Panther. This Panther is now climbing up, trying to snipe. Boom. Eighth kill of the game. Now, this is where I know that I probably should not be whiffing any more shots, making sure that I'm engaging for the Panzer that's coming very soon. Mr. Flipster01 over here is definitely charging up. To hunt me down i'm pinpointing it to be somewhere around here or here i'm just making sure that he doesn't surprise me and then i see him i wait for a lower glacial shot and ninth kill of the game look at this guy on the comment is2 camper in mountain again i'm not a camper i am just playing the tank to its ability I start MGing this guy. And he's gone. Didn't want to waste any rounds. Now at this point the team is reduced to just four of us, I think. Two tanks and two planes. Uh not counting me. Uh it will come down to the wire where it's just me. I remember there was an 88 flak. Uh and um yeah, there we go, that 88 flag. Okay, and I see this Junker coming up my way. Reverse. He drops his bomb way too late. But I do not make it easier for him. Enemy Panther comes up. 10th kill of the game. <clears throat> Double ace just like that. Protecting Alpha. Making sure nothing comes my uh, team's way. And that's where that stupid... Um, 88 flag force and this guy is shooting me I don't want to shoot my MG how did I not see that LV and then I slowly realized that there's a panther coming like, oh my god hello panther and flipster I killed you again it's the guy that is from the panzer he's dead 11 kills pretty much after that we capture it and then we let the tickets bleed out yeah so the is2 an amazing sniper tank definitely recommend for you guys to get this tank uh played at range do not go close range i know if some people were to call you a pussy for camping that's completely fine because remember you're playing a sniper tank to its role you're not playing a brawling tank and sniping from range even if you play a brawling tank and you snipe someone from range 
they're the one that's lacking skills, not you. I really kind of uh, saw that comment and just thought, you know what? I've had it with people calling people who play tanks to their specific roles pussy. This ain't no uh, chivalrous kind of thing. I'm playing a sniper tank as a sniper. You won't see a sniper uh, frontlining in actual combat war. And even if this is just a war simulation game, I'm playing it to its uh, potential and style. So with that, everyone, thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe and let me know what I should do next. Till then, peace out. I am out. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. If you like what you saw, don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and don't forget to comment down on the video. Take care.